President Biden is slated to meet Democratic governors today to reassure them of his competence and address escalating discontent among party leaders. This after Texas Congressman Lloyd Doggett became the first Democrat in the House of Representatives to publicly urge the president to step aside. According to a recent Ipsos Reuters poll, one in three Democrats think Biden should end his re-election bid. The calls for the president to sit out of the race are prompted majorly by his stumbling performance during the last week's debate. In an attempt at damage control, the White House in a statement said that the face-off with Trump was nothing but a bad night for Biden. We understand. We understand. We're not taking away from what you all saw or what the American people saw. We understand. It was a bad night. It is not uncommon for incumbents to have a bad night on their first debate. However, the Ipsos Reuters poll also found that no prominent elected Democratic would have fared any better than Biden against Trump. If we talk numbers, both Biden and Trump maintained the support of 40 percent of the registered voters, indicating that Biden has not lost any ground since the CNN debate. As for other Democrats, only Michelle Obama, the former First Lady of the United States, outperformed Biden. Michelle Obama led Trump 50 percent to 39 percent in a hypothetical matchup. This despite becoming author, maintaining that she does not intend to run for president. Speaking of Vice President Kamala Harris, she trailed Trump by one percent point. That is 42 percent to 43 percent, a difference that lies well within the polls 3.5 percent point margin of error. The given statistics show Harris just as strong as Biden. Harris has stepped out of Biden's shadow in recent months, becoming a key voice in the administration for abortion rights. Now coming to the rising star in the Democrats, California Governor Gavit Newsom. He performed marginally worse, trailing Trump 39 percent to 42 percent. None of the elected Democrats tested against Trump have formally declared their candidacies with several barely recognizing at national level. The poll, which was conducted online, surveyed 1,070 U.S. adults nationwide. For all the latest news, download the Weon app and subscribe to our YouTube channel.